it's become clearer that the next generation of services requires building full general intelligence. This technology is so important and the opportunities are so great that we should open source and make it as widely available as we responsibly can so that everyone can benefit. In a bold move, Meta has reorganized its AI structure, shifting the powerful engine that was once locked away under the CTO's control directly into the heart of the factory, the product teams. Imagine Meta's AI as a high-performance engine, previously confined to the garage. Now it's unleashed, powering the machines that drive Meta's apps and services. So what does this mean for Meta's business? Let's explore the positives. With the engine's power directly harnessed, Meta can roll out new features and enhance existing ones at an unprecedented pace. Imagine sharper ad targeting, smarter content recommendations and more engaging user experiences. The factory representing the product teams guides the engine on which tasks to prioritize. This ensures that AI development aligns seamlessly with user and business needs, leading to solutions that directly address critical business goals. Engineers and AI experts now work hand-in-hand, hand, fostering smoother integration of AI into products. This collaborative environment has the potential to spark innovative ideas, pushing Meta's capabilities to new heights. Of course, with every bold move, there are potential drawbacks. Let's delve into the negatives. Less research freedom. The close-knit factory environment might exert pressure on the engine to focus on immediate repairs and upgrades potentially neglecting long-term research on groundbreaking new technologies. Short-term focus. Prioritizing short-term product goals could inadvertently sideline the development of potentially disruptive AGI technology. This may put Meta at risk of falling behind competitors who remain invested in long-term research. Ethical concerns. Placing a powerful engine in everyone's hands raises valid ethical concerns. Issues like bias, transparency, and potential job displacement need to be addressed responsibly by Meta to maintain trust and prevent harm. In conclusion, Meta's AI reorg is a daring move with the potential for both benefits and risks. It could propel product development and AI integration to new heights, but not without potential costs to long-term research and ethical considerations. Only time will reveal if this bold approach fuels Meta's success or presents unforeseen challenges. It's become clearer that the next generation of services requires building full general intelligence. Building the best AI assistants, AIs for creators, AIs for businesses, and more. That needs advances in every area of AI, from reasoning to planning to coding to memory and other cognitive abilities. This technology is so important and the opportunities are so great that we should open source and make it as widely available as we responsibly can so that everyone can benefit. Hey everyone, today I'm bringing Meta's two AI research efforts closer together to support our long-term goals of building general intelligence, open sourcing it responsibly, and making it available and useful to everyone in all of our daily lives.